happy new year of my friend and all of my subscriber and all of my viewer so this is the program we are going to make this one in 2020 what 2020 because it is the last day of this year and we are going to wish all of you the happy new year of 2021 so this is a cool animation we are going to make this one in the studio so let's get started so let's close it right now so i will create a file with whole code in my sublet text so here is it so you can see here all of my code in my sublet text so now i am going to explain on the code line by line so first what you need to do we need to create six files so you can see a file one file two file three file four file five and the file six so these files actually contain all the ascii character okay so file one you can see here it will contain happy it will contain new it will contain year and it will contain 2021 and it will contain using and this one python logo so first what you need to do we need to generate this text okay so let's use it and go to the firefox so dear people channel and i also wish all of you a subscriber our channel is growth on 2000 subscriber okay so first what you need to do you need to go to this website online tools.com and you can see here a text and a square so then i need to put here some text here so let's put here happy so it will generate the uh, text from here you need to uh, click on to copy the clipboard so it will copy on your clipboard and go to the folder directory where you are going to make this one and you need to create a file with a text file just click on here new and the bank text file you can see here uh, what do you call yes text document so inside this text document you need to put here all these ascii code okay line by line it should be the image or it should be the text okay so this one just open this in your notebook so in my case you can see here notepad is open and just control b so it will right now passed here so you need to um, copy all the files from this ascii tools.com website and you need to create some files now what you need to do right now we need to create a program which can um, load this ascii character and make this one in an animation format okay so you need to uh, um, you need to what do you call it don't save right now okay uh, let's delete it right now so i already uh, generate all the files here file 1 file 2 and file 3 and the file 4 and the file 5 and in file 6 there is a picture of the python logo so this is our python logo python language dot logo type so this is the logo we are going to use it so now we need to generate this logo in a ascii format okay I think it will take some time to load. You can see here it is a Python logo. So we are going to make this photo in a ASCII format. So that's why we are also using a website. Okay. So let's go here. So this is the website you see uh, textimage.com. Yep. So you need to click on the browse. I already browse it here. Just click on the image and image height. Let's put here uh, 40. And you need to just click on the convert so it will convert a text here of the ASCII character of this your image okay just i take a while because my internet is so slow and take some time to load this you can see here you can also generate this one okay so you can see here it is generate a picture of the python logo with a ASCII format okay so i already make a video uh, on my youtube channel how can you generate the text into ASCII format also the picture maybe uh, it in this row you can see here I, I upload more videos okay you can see here ASCII art using python okay and the pipiclet so you can also use this program to generate the ASCII um, what do you call ASCII uh, character and also the ASCII picture okay so this one also help you to generate this one okay so now you can see here uh, this is a front selection okay so banner 3d right now so you need to just select this banner 3d or you can generate this banner 3d by using python in this tutorial so please check my tutorial ascii art using python and pyficlet 
So it will also help you to how can you generate all those key vector using Python. So now it's time to code. Okay. So let's minimize it and go to the sublime text here. So you can see here file 1.txt, file 2, file 3, file 4, and file 5, and the file 6. The file 6 is actually containing the image of the Python in a ASCII format. So you can see here this is the Python file new year.py. So first what you need to do, you need to import the OS ID, then we are going to import the time module. Why should we need to put here the time module? Because we are going to do some animation. That's why you have to some sleeping method also. And we also put here the colorama, so it will help us to uh, make our text in some coloring format. Let's say I am using uh, red. You can also use some color format like uh, green, blue, whatever you can. Okay. And you need to clear this screen just a while. So you can put here OS dot system clear screen. That means when I write this code, let's say and execute once one more time, and you can easily uh, easily see how. Why should I use the OS dot system as inside this parameter? I have to put here CLS. Why? Put here the CMT. When I run this program on my system, you can see here these uh, uh, command. Uh, I mean, command word would uh, actually clear. Okay. So let's say new year dot py. Take some time to load this here. Okay. You can see here these uh, pop up will gone right now. Just animation. Just animation right now. So click on here to close this. So it will close it right now. Okay. So now what we need to do, we need to iterate all the file name. So that's why you have to create a list of this file name. So you can see a file name equal inside this list. I put here all the file name with text. Okay. File name with text. Then I create a, uh, I define a function called animator. So inside this parameter, I put here the file name and daily as one, one second and the repeat, it will be repeat in 10, 10 times. Or you can say 10 iteration okay so this is the whole thing okay and i create a blank list of the frames okay so it will actually uh, iterate all the frames from this file name and now i am going to iterate all the file name inside my name and i'm going to open all this file at creating encoding technique utf8 because this is a text we need to encode it so that's we have to put here encoding utp at it okay if you don't put it it will give me it will definitely give you an error okay as f and we are going to put all these all this text character inside this frame and we create a nested loop here first we are going to uh, repeat all the things repeat should be 10 or 20 just iterate all the things and we are iterate all the frames inside this frame so you can see here frames in frame after iterating we are print here a color four dot graph so you can see here uh, over uh, from colorama we are going to import 4 and the back okay so 4 would help us to uh, generate some color or also back is help us to change the background okay so i also uh, show you so more interesting and now we need to join this frame inside this uh, frame okay and you put here as time dot sleep as a daily so it will help us to create the animator in some uh, seconds and you also clear the skin okay after the happy then skin clear the skin then new and clear the skin then year and 2021 then we put here or we call the function three times to generate more perfectly okay so so let's run it right now i think uh code is more uh, complex okay don't worry i will put this uh, link on my video description of the github link okay so let's finish with it and run this and see how actually it will work. Okay. So click on here, CMD, and type uh, Python new year, uh -huh, new year dot py. So you can see here the screen is right now clear. Okay, 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 okay. You can see here OS is already clean. Okay. Using Python logo. Happy new year 2021 using Python logo. Okay. You can see Python. So if I close this and if I try to change the background of my command prompt or you can say CMD. So what you need to do, we need to use this back. Okay. So you need to put here this back here. So print uh, and the back color should be, you need to put here a back of this background color. So the back means actually the background color, the back dot and the color name, let's say light 
or you can say magnetic ex that's it okay uh, save it for control s or you can also put it here and save all and again go to dear and type cmd and type python new year dot five so right now you can see here these command prompt is converted into a light color okay so this is the uses of the back you can see also say background and no need to do this okay you can comment out right now it's okay so comment out and again save it and go to the command prompt again and run it same thing and the python new year here what do you call year dot py i also minimize all the thing here okay so actually this uh, tutorial with premium on 2020 the first hour at i mean this night in this night 12 am 12 am yes maybe 12 am so this video is premium on this day so i will also wish you all you happy new year okay so enter so it will generate this ask you art happy new year 2021 using python so this is the last video on this year okay in next year we are going to make some amazing and cool things using python and you also do some project using machine learning and data science natural language processing and so on okay so thank you guys for watching this video and make sure to subscribe my channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon for never miss an update and thank you bye bye stay safe